Hello everybody. On this video I wanted to show you how to test your SART search and rescue radio transponder on X-band radar. So you have to make this test only using the X-band radar. And uh, this test you will make uh, monthly and before departure of each port. So what is the main? What the setting you should choose on the X-band radar? At first you need to choose the correct range. Minimum 6 nautical miles. Because if you will use the small range, it will not possible to see the rounds, uh, the signal from your SART. So just choose 6 nautical miles range or 12. And now I will come to show you how to test the SART. After we will see the signal on the display. Company of my SART is your Tron, model Tron SART 20. Maybe you will have some another company and uh, different models, uh, but it's never mind. Usually, its procedure is the same, just uh, different constructions. So, directly on the SART, you can find the procedure, how to test, test instructions, how to test it, and uh, how to use it in case of emergency. Operating instructions use only in emergency, and you can see the procedure is here. In case of emergency, you will need to remove this safety pin, pull it out, and shift this button to position on. So when you are testing, don't touch this uh, safety pin. For the testing, you will need to push this button down to position test, like on the instruction. So push switch to test position, second observe indicator light flashing. Indicator light will flash here and uh, return switch to off position. So the test we will make from, from the wing. You can make it from the wing. And now we are going to the wing to test it. So when you are already on the wing, push this button down to position test for at least 5 seconds. So you can see the flashing light. And now we are going to the X-Band Radar to check it. So now on the X-Band Radar you can see the result of our testing. You can see these green rings. It's catching the signal from uh, our SART. It means that our SART is operational and in good working condition. The test is passed. So now the range is 12 nautical miles. You can choose the 6 nautical miles. You will also see these green rings. So why I'm telling you to choose the normal normal range? Because if some inspection is coming on board, uh, usually in port, uh, uh, some uh, PSC inspection, and they're asking you to show how you test in the SART, if is your SART is operational or not. Uh, so usually in port, the range is very small on the radar less than one mile. So, on the small range, as you can see, it's not possible to see these rings. So, my friends, if this video was useful for you, press the like, button subscribe, and in the next video I will show you how to make performance monitoring test, PM test, on the Radar GRC. Thank you very much, and goodbye.